Guys, are you sick and tired from grinding Outriders non-stop and still getting nowhere? If yes, then this video will be perfect for you, my beautiful bastard. Long story short, I will show you right now the biggest secret how you can efficiently get ascension points. If you are curious about apocalypse tears and how you can unlock them quickly, I have made already a video on this topic. You need second player for that method and he needs to be at higher tier so he could share his tears to you. If you don't have that friend, hit me up on Xbox, I will gladly help you all. Let's get those tears quickly up. But in terms of ascension points, all the magic happens at Eye of the Storm expedition. And maybe you noticed that a lot of players are farming this expedition. And that's for a good fucking reason. I am farming this mission since day one or early access actually. Because you can get a ridiculous amount of XP and that's the way how I reach 200 the ascension of the points. I am maxed out what? and I unlocked all you? the apocalypse tiers no. with that exploit yeah. easy bug. Imagine to unlock all tiers for 4 characters, it's absolutely disgusting. So <laughs> you need to save your time and do these little cheesy things because the grind is real here. What you want to do in Eye of the Storm mission? Well, but before we continue, quick word from the sponsor, Deving.net. If you don't have enough time or good teammates, but you still want to have all the best items in your game, then Deving.net is set for you. They have absolutely amazing team on consoles. They will complete your order super quick. Everything happens through icon sharing. This service has been working for many, many years. They have done so customer reviews. You can check everything by yourself, but now with my promo code RBDIV, you will have 15% discount on all services. Amazing deal, especially even right now, they have some crazy sales. And if you have any questions, simply drop a comment down below or contact the operator and he will tell you everything. And in terms of the best XP farming method right now, like I said, all the magic happens at Eye of the Swarm. You can do this in solo, in team play, doesn't matter. If you have a decent enough setup with all the old enemies, you will be just fine. You need to activate all the totems in this mission. If you're gonna activate all three totems, you will receive insane amount of mobs. And best part about this mission is that developers can't nerf this. They can't do really anything about this mission. If they will nerf amount of enemies will come out from activating one totem, that means that this mission will be super easy, super quick. And uh, yeah, if they, again, if they will limit this mission to maybe two or three waves of enemies with one totem or one totem activation again that will make this mission super easy and this should be one of the hardest expedition in the game so there is nothing really developers can do about this so you don't have to worry about any nerves or fixes in the near future or ever i guess so activate all three totems so all the maximum amount of enemies will come after you and take the seat behind the basically ammo box or near the entrance go back where you started the mission so you would gather them in narrow tunnel and deal the maximum damage or I should say with one swing you would deal the maximum damage on, on the maximum amount of enemies so don't fight in open field. Go back where you started next to that ammo box you see in the background. Go in there and wait. Enemies, trust me, will come for you. <laughs> they will come for you. Take advantage of this method. Reach level 200. Butcher of the mic. See you in the next one. Bye.